Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Sagittarius, June 23, 2023. You can feel quite empowered and confident on a mental plane today. You ascent a ascent re also in a strong position to do research and analysis. Insight into health or work methods can be quick and clever. You ascent a ascent re not content to only talk about problems you want to take steps towards resolving them. Sometimes talking about tricky topics requires an approach that involves jumping right in and winging it from there, and this is the kind of energy with you now. This is also a great time for improving your skills and finding meaningful ways to be of help and service to others. Unique channels or methods for self-expression draw you in. You may be considering special ways to improve your health and wellness, help others, or devote extra time to pet projects. As the sun makes its way throughout the 12 zodiac signs, it visits each for a month of the year. Today, as our great luminary charges onward into new seas, we officially usher in cancer season. This is a lovely period of the year for the human collective because we experience a more sensitive, empathic energy. You have a deeply loving nature underneath it all, and during this time, you may find that you are even more open to sacrificing your time, love, attention, and resources for others. Be of a giving spirit, and the universe will also reward you. Focus on your professional commitments. Your relationships, contracts, obligations, and more will come into focus when the sun enters your opposite sign. Although cancer season is quite different from yours, this could be an excellent opportunity to dive into your feelings. Work does not always have to be so stoic and serious. It is okay to reflect on what you think and feel about your professional commitments since your emotions matter. Doing so can even help you clarify what you do and do not like about your arrangements. For the first and usually for the only time this year, the Moon and Venus align in your financial sector today, with your financial instincts and imagination merging with the planet of money's influence. This is something that can add more fuel to your financial desires and expectations but also add to your chances of turning those desires into reality. As the first of several alignments before Venus leaves in October there is no urgency to make this usually just one encounter count. The planets are giving you lots of fresh energy to play with. The energy is fanciful and light, yet significant. This is not a time to enjoy the silly things in life and forget the rest, but rather to expand your horizons and invite the new into your life. Give up the habits that have kept you in stuck positions. Change does not have to be intense and traumatic but it does take work. Drink red clover tea to help your blood break down those stuck places. This is an excellent day for allowing your natural creativity to be expressed. On a day, the arts will more than likely be very important to you. You may well find that nothing brings you more pleasure. Consider putting this to good use by making some cards or gifts for those you care about. You will find that you are very receptive to enjoying anything artsy today, but more so, engaging in art activities with a focus on giving may be the perfect thing for you. Thanks to the moon's departure from your relationship sector yesterday, you are better able to hit the ground running as the sun returns today. This isn't just because of the chance that the moon has given you to ensure you are emotionally engaged from the start. A clash with Pluto in Capricorn and a friendly aspect to planets on the communication front before leaving yesterday saw the moon leave you with a better sense of what you want from your relationships and what they need from you and with a chance to have the communication lines open from the start. A day after the moon wrapped up its first visit to your relationship sector since Pluto returned to Capricorn and as any strong emotional responses dial back, the sun returns. It was the moon's clash with Pluto just as it formed a friendly aspect to the dwarf planet series as she left your relationship sector that has left you with a better sense of what you want from your relationships and what they need from you and the communication lines open, as the sun turns the solar onto your relationships. Our eyes in the sky. Today, the sun in Cancer opposes Pluto retrograde in Capricorn, setting the stage for a transformative and introspective day. 
Your mind is seeking expansion and growth, but it's important to remain patient if the outside world struggles to keep pace with your inner aspirations. As the day progresses, your attention may turn toward reflecting on how you've evolved throughout your life and envisioning the person you want to become in the future. The energy of the day can feel weighty at times, but remember that you hold the power to release anything that holds you back. By letting go of limiting beliefs or negative influences, you will emerge victorious by day's end. However, it's essential not to isolate yourself entirely. Spending excessive time alone can lead to emotional intensity and feelings of loneliness, even for those who typically enjoy solitude. Whether you're engaging in work or social interactions, approaching situations with composure and consideration will yield greater results than forcefulness. Your interpersonal skills will be put to the test, and simply demonstrating your ability to connect with others is all that's required. However, to strengthen your relationship with your partner, it's important to involve them in your activities and include them in your plans. Today presents a highly promising opportunity for significant new acquisitions. Trust your instincts when it comes to identifying good offers and don't easily be intimidated. If needed, your friends will provide honest advice to assist you in making sound decisions. Make wise use of any surplus cash by investing it wisely. Things will likely run smoothly, and you will be able to find lucrative deals that align with your goals. A tingling sensation coursing through your body refuses to let you rest. It's a signal that it's time to step into action and bring to fruition plans that have been brewing for quite some time. Whether these plans are personal or professional in nature, seize the moment to make them a reality. However, as you embrace this active phase, be cautious not to take on an excessive amount of tasks. Overcommitting yourself may result in unproductive restlessness and absent-mindedness. When it comes to your finances, things may not be in the best shape. It seems that you're unable to see the potential benefits and find yourself making repeated mistakes. Avoid engaging in large-scale investments, as your financial advisors are likely to steer you towards unfavorable deals. Instead, focus on smaller expenses to minimize any potential harm. Recently, the moon formed a harmonious connection with the south node in your financial sector, providing you with a balanced perspective on both the income and expense aspects of your financial situation. With the lunar nodes nearing the end of their transit in your money houses, they continue to work towards achieving equilibrium. Take advantage of this balanced view while it lasts. Your work environment may be characterized by insecurity and confrontations. It's important not to let yourself become overwhelmed by the lack of immediate answers to every problem. Maintain a calm and composed exterior, avoiding actions that may exacerbate your issues. Often, even the most serious catastrophes pass as quickly as they arise. As Mercury concluded its time in your income sector 12 days ago, it aligned with planets that remain in that sector, including Pluto in your career sector and the dwarf planet Ceres in your job sector. Shortly after the departure of Ceres from your work sector, the moon returns, offering you an opportunity to assess and evaluate matters across the income, work, and career domains. Take advantage of this chance to gain insights and make informed decisions.